Hey guys, what's up? So I wanted to show you um, a little birthday celebration that I put together for Autumn. She turned 29. I know I don't share too much of um, this part of my life with you guys, but um, to the new people, I do have a disabled child. This is Autumn and it's her birthday today. She's 29 years old. I know she doesn't look like it, but she's very um, 29 today. So here I am just feeding her pizza. She really likes to eat. That is like one of the things that she actually enjoys in life is eating. You can see how she's excited about the pizza. Um, I did a fog machine. She's like, what the hell? And this is just us singing to her. And my cat in the way. I was trying to get her to grab it. She wouldn't do it. And now we're just feeding her birthday cake. She really likes it. She gets excited right there. You can see, you see she's smiling. She looks really happy about the cake. She likes to eat. I'm trying to show her what we got, but she's more interested in the cake. You see, she likes to eat. Like I said, she really enjoys eating and she, like most people, loves to eat. And I'm trying to get her to look at, focus on the stuff that we got. And she was like, no, I had to put it in her eyes. And then she went right back to the cake. <laughs> oh, she was not caring about any of the stuff that we got her anyway. Um, I just wanted to share that little bit of my life with you guys. Like I said, I just don't show her that much. Um, I just don't, I don't know. It's, it's difficult part of my life and it's stressful and I use these little videos to escape my real life. So that's why. I really don't show her that much. I know that some people may find it interesting or whatever, but it's too much to share for me. But I just thought I would share her birthday with you guys. And um, thanks for watching this part of it. Um, so, yeah. And we're going to do a little confetti cannon for her. She wasn't really paying attention. I don't know. Couldn't take her eyes off the cake, but she was like, oh, what's going on? Must not be guilty of <laughs> hey, guys. 
I'm going thrifting and I'm taking you with me. Um, now that I live in a new city, well, I this is the same city that I always go to, but I actually live here. So I get to go to more stores in one day and we're here at our first today and let's see let's see if there's anything amazing in here or not where are we gonna go 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 I need a chest of drawers because I've ran out of space in my new place for clothes and I need a chest of drawers so maybe we can find one um these clips are a little bit out of order but this was at humanity habitat for humanity I just love that curio and these chairs they were like $19 they were in pretty good condition I thought they were really cool caning and with the print I love this friggin old chest I want to get something to put my tv on in my living room and I thought about getting this and painting it silver which I thought is really cool um but I don't have a truck or anything to bring it but this old set was really cool I think they wanted $40 for it this table I think they wanted $40 as well I just thought it was a nice table for 40 and this lampshade was really nice for like three bucks and then they have this bed it's upside down but i don't know how much they wanted for that and then i thought these these were original art pieces they were like 20 dollars a piece and so was this original art as well i thought they were really nice i mean of course i didn't get them but I just really thought they were really nice like mid-century modern they would they could look really cool in, in a house like if you decorate it and then i thought about this one as well painting it silver it was 99 dollars. i just don't have a truck i did pick this up to resell i didn't pick that up to resell but it was 1933 i thought that was really cool um i did pick this up and we are gonna make many donuts i picked this up pillow up for resale it's um a designer oh my gosh i was so excited about these <gasps> and they only wanted 20 i mean 39 dollars for that i mean i just don't have a place for it but i would buy that and put all my perfume in it die and this one as well. I have this one already. Um, I've had it for years. And this one was 29 I paid like 125 for mine. I just thought this friggin' spinning wheel was like huge and wild. You never really see that. And I love this one as well. Um, I want something like this. And then I went to another Goodwill on another day. And I found this Balenciaga girl. Balenciaga sweater. And I have a Jeffree Star tracksuit thing on which I bought and that hat was there and then I bought this to resell it's like I thought this little thing was really cute vanity set I don't know if it's older it kind of looks older and then this table was amazing they wanted $79 for that um I was thinking about getting that and then and then I thought this was really interesting. It was metal and you could put like candles. I thought that was really nice. It was like really huge. And then it was like this little birthday. I mean not birthday thing but perfume thing. And this crystal drum. Um, this is like those candles that are like coiled up. I just never saw one that had a jack-o'-lantern. I thought that was really cool. I love this clock. I've never seen anything like with it, like a pinkish red. I've never seen one like that. And here's some Fenton um, dessert cups. Really pretty. And then here's some Coisonay apple. I think I did buy that. Because they resell for like 40 bucks. But I buy so much. I don't remember what I get. This was 
fan was really cute. I know I didn't buy that. Mm, here is a red, red wood piece. And those don't really have that much resale value, so I didn't take it. Sometimes these little spaghetti, they call it like spaghetti trim things, so really well. I thought that was a nice one. And then this was very interesting to me. It's like a tape dispenser. Isn't that fancy? <laughs> I thought it was really cool. It's not worth much to resell, but I just thought that was really cool. And then I thought these were really cool. These are for like um, Christmas ornaments. And I like these wall things. They were like really heavy. And they have some mid-century modern lamps there. Um, I thought this little witch um, stained glass like candle holder was cute. And they had some cute pumpkins. Um, I like this acrylic Hobby Lobby can. I mean, napkin holder. I really like this brass bank. I didn't buy it. I should have got it. But it was kind of scratched up and stuff. But I thought it was cool. Um, I did buy these to resell. But if they don't sell, I am going to... I'm planning on going to Vegas in like February. And there's this place called the Golden Tiki. And I want to dress Tiki. And I'm going to wear those shoes or take those shoes with me. I have a muumu, like Hawaiian muumu and everything. Um, I picked this jacket up to resell. I can wear it. Um, I wore it to the mall the other day. People were like, what? Um, that was $125. And then this is like, a, I don't know. It's like a thing that goes on a horse and it's really big. Um, I paid like 40 something to get that. And then I bought this jacket. It was really amazing. It doesn't do justice on camera, but this jacket is bad. The fucking ass. And then I really like this. I need a Chester drawer, but I want a tall one. I want like a five drawer, not a three drawer. But that was an excellent price on that. I did buy this. This is like a vintage jewelry, like jewelry case. Um, I have to fix that and glue that back on for the rings and stuff. But I'm going to put that in my bathroom. I just thought that was really cool. And... Here is a purse that I was going to get, but I didn't. I thought that would have been a good for the tiki thing, but I thought these lips purse was cute and this little tiny. I don't know. That was just so cute. And this purse was really nice. It was leather. And then they had this brand new with tag wicker bag that I thought was really cute. I did not get, but <coughs> I have one. I have several. Um, and then here's some Tory Birch loafers. I think they were like sevens, the reason why I didn't get them. And they were $14. And then I thought these boots were really nice. Kind of really good for winter. And then there's the jewelry thing over there. That's the way it looks. It's like really cool. And I haven't put it in my bathroom yet, but I'm going to. Girl, I'm always buying stuff. I don't need to be spending all this money. But, um, uh, this was a, a turtle lamp. That's where you sell pretty well. If it was a little bit cheaper, I would have bought it. Um, I just thought this was pretty. Literally, there was hardly anything in there. Like, nothing at all. But I went earlier to Starbucks and I got this cup. I thought it was so pretty. And earlier I went to Ulta and got some whipped, it's called Tropical Grow Firming Whipped Shea Butter. It smells really good. I got this. So I went a little shopping before I turned you guys on here. Um, but yeah, that, that thrift store was not having anything good so we're on to the next
so yeah um, I did buy that Balenciaga sweater there is my little girl wearing it. it is so cute and it's so authentic so thanks for watching you guys hope you enjoyed this video till next time bye